So let's see how the first command we're going to learn works. Notice how my prompt and the title look like. This tilt sign references my home directory. Because I'm root, my home directory's name is going to be root. And I can verify this by typing pwd, which outputs slash root, telling me that I am currently in the working directory of root. Let's say I want to change this and I want to go to the temp directory. I can do that easily by typing cd space slash temp. And notice now that my prompt has changed to temp and also the title of my window has changed to temp. I can verify this and double check it by typing pwd which outputs slash tmp telling me that my current working directory now is temp. Let's say I want to move one level up. If you remember the directory structure, the slash or the root directory is the very first directory where all the other directories branch out from. And this happens to be the one level up of temp. I can do that by typing cd slash dot dot and notice that the prompt has changed and the title on my window has also changed to the slash telling me now that I am in the root directory. Not the home of user root, but the actual root directory. So now if I type pwd, my output is going to be a slash as opposed to the slash root that we saw earlier. That might be a bit confusing. So let me now go back to my home. My username is root. And the way I can go back to my home directory is by typing cd space and tilde. This is a shortcut that says take me to home. Notice again that my prompt has changed and the title of my window has changed. Now if I type pwd, I should expect to see slash root. Let me go back to the temp directory. Another way to go to home instead of typing cd space tilde is to just type cd and hit enter. And again, I can verify that by typing pwd. You might be wondering at this point why there are two different ones. We'll see why later on when we're using the absolute paths to file. One last trick we can use if I want to go to the previous directory, kind of like hitting the back button, I can do cd space dash. And that will take me back to the temp directory that I was just in.